Hey guys, TKC here, the Kaijudo channel, and I have an awesome package here in the mail from Removal Video on YouTube. Um, he is an awesome guy from Japan, and he's a fan of both Duel Masters and Kaijudo, I guess, since they're, you know, very similar games. And so he's been following Kaijudo and, I guess, Duel Masters for quite a while now, you know, even before Kaijudo started, or maybe roughly where it started. Um, you know, he sent one of these massive packages to the Earth Power Crew, which is pretty awesome. And just recently, maybe maybe like two months ago or so, uh, he sent me a message saying he wanted to send me one for my one year anniversary for the channel, for the Kaijudo channel on YouTube. And so we worked out a bunch of stuff and he says, alright, I'll look for this, I'll look for this, and bam, he sent me a package right here. So I'm going to go ahead and open all this up right now and I'm really excited to see what's in here. So let's get straight to it. Let's get, start opening this baby. I put this bag here just because uh, I don't want people to see the addresses. Uh, I already started opening it a little bit so hopefully this will help out in the long run here. Don't hurt yourself too good. Yeah, so this is Wednesday right now. Today's Wednesday. I just got back home like yesterday. I actually went to go work yesterday, even though I just landed in Montreal. So it's pretty funny. I only took a half day though, since I was like really kind of jet lagged. Uh, but anyway, almost there. Okay. There we go. It is open. All right. So let's see what we got here. We got uh. Lucky Dogi Blast. Oh, okay, it, it, it's a postcard. Uh, he says, Hey there, feeling lucky? Well, I heard you like animu and manga. Well, ever try reading manga in Japanese? It's easy. For example, try dot dot dot. Um, okay, so I guess, I don't know, we'll see. Oh god, <laughs> what is this? Okay, so here's a an excerpt, I guess, of uh, a manga. A couple pages, I guess. I don't know, he just ripped something out of one of his books, I guess. And, uh, well, I can't read anything here, but, uh, actually, alright, well, there's English, uh, letters and Japanese here, so I don't know, uh, there's an English character in a Japanese manga, so it has, like, Japanese and English there at the same time, uh, but, uh, anyway, that's really funny. <laughs> Not really sure what's going on there, but anyways, it's English and a Japanese manga, so, there you go, there's that. Um, there's a lot of, like, bags in here, I think, th I think they're just put in there as fillers to kind of, like, surprise me between stuff I open, so, uh, so this is Yuzawaya bag, alright, um, okay, let's see what we got here, ooh, it's a red panda, oh, well, at least I think it is, my girlfriend really likes red pandas, so, anyway, oh my god, that's a lot of words, <laughs> dear TKC, wasn't that fun, okay, serious letter time, please find enclosed a small sampling of what Japan bring, Japan brim brings with. There's probably too much to comment on in this postcard, so you may well discover neat things omitted here. But here are some highlights. After this postcard is wait. After this post, I can't read. It's so hard to read because it's so small. You have to see this. Hold on. Look at this. He just wrote like a novel on this tiny postcard, and I'm supposed to be able to read this. After this is posted, is a cool shopping bag from Quirky Goods Bookstore Village. Vanguard. Then a pengi notebook to remind you of your Canadian roots. There are penguins in Canada, right? Exactly. You can track duels in this revolutionary paper product too, as per DCI policy. To help inspire you to write, here are hiragana and katakana stickers shaped like things that start with that character. Example, O for Okami, which is wolf. Uh, next is a neat poster mag for Japan mate. Uh, a rare poster for the One Piece museum show I went to. Ridiculously cool. Now the fun stuff. The cover to legendary Koro Koro, Koro a donut carrying case samples of what in <laughs> it's so hard to read. Sample of what in tell your interiors? Interiors to a phone book style manga mag shonen jump. Uh looks like a, a DM quad deck case. Quad. He just said quad deck case. I guess that means uh um, a, a case that can carry four decks or something, uh, and a mystery box and more. Inside the DM case are packs of Kion Precious Memories, plus some neat DM pa Okay, you know what, I'm not gonna read this. <laughs> I'm gonna read this later, because it's kinda like spoiling the whole surprise of what's in the package. 
Uh, but I'll, I'll be sure to read that. that. That's just really long. Okay, so, all right, here is the penguin notebook, or the pengi notebook, I like to say. Uh, that's kind of cute. La Dolce Vita. Uh, natural living, and it's a notebook, so I could use it to uh, take notes in duels and stuff and have a, a, you know, a cute little penguin next to me. Oops, I just dropped that. Um, okay, so here's what he was talking about. The hiragana katakana stickers that are shaped like things that have the syllable in it or something. So that's kind of cool. Uh, you know, if I ever want to learn Japanese, these will help me out. Uh, I also bought, like, uh, Japanese learning cards on my Seattle trip when I was with my friends, so that's pretty cool. Thanks for that. That's really awesome. Uh, another shopping bag. That's what he was talking about. He just has these shopping bags to kind of, like, go in between things. Uh, Alright, some, some album shopping bag thing. Um, okay, what do we got here? Japan meat subculture. Okay. Uh, interesting. Uh, ooh, Donkey Kong Returns 3D. That's that's cool. There's a huge thing over there. And okay, so it's just kind of like a. I think he I think he mentioned this in the postcard too. Kind of like an insert of sorts uh, in a Koro Koro magazine or something. So that's that's pretty neat. Lots of interesting stuff you can only find in Japan. Okay, here's what he was talking about. A one piece poster to a one piece show he went to that's pretty neat uh, I believe it was at a mall or something 52nd floor geez that, that's a lot of floors um, alright um, another bag with a comic on it Village Vanguard he was also talking about that too um, alright uh, okay so oh wow alright there, there's a lot of stuff here Alright, so here is the donut case, um, alright, mini donut case to, to carry your donuts. Uh, you know, we actually have something very similar to this in uh, Canada. We have Tim Hortons, and that restaurant gives you a Timbits, which are like, not mini donuts, but they're like mini, kind of like balls that are like donut balls, basically. And you eat those, and they're shaped in these kind of things, too, so it's kind of cool. But this is like a, a cute, interesting one from Japan, so that's awesome. Now here, okay, I don't know how I'm going to get this out, uh, I hope, uh, okay, it's just like a, it's a cover, I guess, I don't know what happened, I don't know if it fell out or something, or maybe you just ripped it off, but it's a cool, um, cover of a Duel Masters, uh, magazine, or maybe this is Koro Koro, I might be mistaken, I don't know, but as you can tell, there's a lot of, like, Duel Masters stuff on there, which is pretty cool. Oh, and here, okay, maybe, maybe that's what happened, I don't know if it got damaged or something, but... Here, here appears to be a lot of pages. Uh, I don't know. I'm not sure if that was supposed to happen. I hope not. I hope I hope it wasn't supposed to come in like this. But uh, anyway, uh, there's a a bunch of mangas in here. Um, all right, that's cool. Um, okay, so wow, look at this. <laughs> this is awesome. Duel Masters trading card game. It's apparently a quad case, so this could hold four decks, I guess. Wow, that's insane. There's a lot of room in there, and there's a lot of stuff in here, too. Oh, jeez. <laughs> it just goes on and on. All right, so we have cool Duel Masters dividers. That's so awesome. One red, one white. So that's how you hold all these decks in here. Actually, no, there's more. There's a blue one, too. So there you go. That's how you hold four decks. You split them up with those dividers. Um, what is this? Um, okay, uh... I think this is like a gift card to go to a maid cafe or something. I'm not exactly sure, but it says right here. Uh, well, let me focus on that. License of Your Majesty, an international official license card. You got a license of level one, my master. Okay. And uh, it never expires. It's, it's infinite, as you can see right here. It is infinite. That's amazing. And yeah, there's, I don't know, stuff there. Uh, start and rank up and stuff and it's at the fourth floor of this place and he got it like one day before my birthday or something or one day after my birthday but all right uh that's very interesting um okay so he got me uh K-On sleeves cool uh from the K-On movie too that's pretty cool of my favorite character so all right that's awesome i got sleeves woohoo uh i think there's more sleeves here too there's a duel masters shield trigger sleeves that's pretty awesome. This is pretty much uh, the Duel Masters version of Shield Blast. So that's really awesome. There's stuff in there too. Uh, and then this is, uh, oh wow. 
like golden Duel Master sleeves. That's, that looks really cool. The World of Duel Masters is bursting with shield bashing creatures and mind warping spells. Never give up and rule the duel. That's what it says on the bottom. Very neat stuff there. Uh, what's this? Oh, a cute little Cerno pin from Toho. Another series I really like. That's cool. Uh, and then, oh my god, oh my god, what is in here? Lots of stuff. Uh, it appears to be like one of every uh, pack uh, of, of stuff. I don't know, let's see, like here there's a Kaon pack. I think this is from another card game in Japan called Precious Memories. We got a Duel Masters pack here of DM23, it's the 23rd set. A black, uh, a black box pack, which is really awesome. Apparently there's a joke cards in here and stuff like that and there might be a Tatsurion in here too I believe this is the set but I'm not sure um, a DMX 13 Zenith pack they're pretty cool and we got DMR 04 and DMR 09 uh, tons of packs to open but I don't have time to open those right now and uh, oh well that's pretty cool uh, a, a drawing of Katora San a recent anime and I'm guessing he drew this himself because he's got some skills with that and oh wait Look at that! Oh my god! I just noticed that! Oh, that's so cool! I just noticed that right now! If you look at the background, that is the background I usually have in my videos. That is super cool. <laughs> she is in my house right now, apparently. Uh, oh my god, the, like, the little figures over here, like, my, my figures in front of my mangas and everything. Wow, that is, like, spot-on detail right there. <laughs> like, games leaning on top of other games over here. Wow. That's honestly really cool. That's probably one of the coolest things in here, <laughs> believe it or not. That's amazing. Oh, jeez, there's a pack of cards here. Um, alright. Let's see what we got in here, I guess. Uh, alright, Seaboy. Uh, for Fortress card. Uh, this is a cross gear. Ooh, a really shiny level 15 thingy. It looks like a triple evolution on the side here on the left. Okay, wow. Uh, what the heck? A level 5, 11k... Um, alright, that's that's pretty cool. Uh, this is a psychic thingy ma bobber. Uh this looks like a Magris, it's a level one five hundred does nothing. Um Oh, is this is this Hogan Blaster? This is the Japanese bottle of wishes. This hate this card. No, just kidding. Uh it's that's pretty cool. Um oh look, it's Lux. Not really. It's it's a Lupia and Duel Masters, but yeah, that's where it came from. Uh ooh, I think that's Void Stalker, the newly revealed Void Stalker. Uh, in Duel Masters is pretty cool. Oh! Oh, yes! That's what I'm talking about! Four Tatsurions from the Duel Masters game. They actually put Tatsurion in Duel Masters as a joke. So that's very funny. Really cool stuff. Um, and I... What is this? I'm not really sure what this is, but this is upside down. It's a level 5 nature spell. I wish I knew what that was. And wow! There is just... There's still so much stuff left in the box. Um, wow, alright, um, okay, so I think I'm gonna cut this off at part one, because there's a lot of stuff in there, and I'm gonna save it for another video, I gotta head out right now, I'm gonna be late for something if I don't leave now, so, uh, yeah, guys, uh, this is TKZ, you guys do a channel, and I just opened, like, a lot of stuff so far, and there's still so much more to go, so, anyways, this is TKZ, the Kaijuo channel, signing off, thanks for watching, stay tuned for part two, where there's even more stuff in there that I can see from here.